Christian unity is a matter that should be taken seriously because God takes it seriously. That's the short, short thesis that um, I put to you now. See, in, in the Bible, the Lord Jesus prays that all his disciples everywhere at all times will be one. One in their fellowship with him, one in their life together. And when the Apostle Paul writes about the church, he talks about there being unity of the Spirit as a given reality which embraces all Christians here and now. So church unity doesn't mean primarily or even essentially um, church union, though a lot of people make that mistake and think it does. Christian unity means acknowledging that we are all of us sharers in the love of the same Savior and the power of the same Holy Spirit and the worship of the same Heavenly Father and being together in that brings us together as brothers and sisters in a single family so that all Christians straight away must see themselves as brothers, sister or sisters and friends to every other Christian in the world. One of the wonderful things that happens worldwide is the people of different race, different background, different culture, when they find that they are fellow Christians, embrace each other, are instant friends with each other, love and care for each other, and rejoice in being together. It's a glorious thing which is only known in the church. People think that life in the church is all dull. When one starts to experience Christian unity with fellow believers, one realizes just how false that is.